Hey guys, Robustius back again for another video, and this part of the video is not going to be very fun because my mailman was not smart. Look at how he popped the po packed the pop. He put it in here, and it's literally so tight. The corners are so tight that I can't pull this out. I'm going to have to yank it out, and it's probably going to damage the box because the corners are literally up against there, and I tried like wiggling and sliding it out, and it's just not budging. So now I'm going to have to yank it and probably damage the box. Hey guys, Robustius back again for another video, and now... I am back from getting it out of the mailbox. Turns out since Hot Topic has so much experience and they've had so many exclusives, they actually know how to properly pack these for shipping because inside that cardboard box was the pop in an actual Funko branded box with like a little pull tab and everything. So I'll go ahead and then open this up. Hopefully no damage on the figure. I don't like buying these online, but since like the exclusive got delisted, like this pop was delisted from the website and I was trying to find it online, like on Amazon or someplace else. And I then saw, oh, it's, okay, the box even like folds open from the sides, my God. And I guess I'll show you after I get it out, but it's like the same kind of box the Funko shop themselves. Okay, no, it's perfect. Um, there's the front, the side, the back, the bottom, and the top. But yeah, as far as I can tell, this thing literally was like, they took it, they got a box of these pops, right? And they just literally took it out, boxed it in this. Or actually, I wonder if they should put boxes on these. Because they have ID codes for what figure it is and the price. So I wonder if they literally ship like a big box, a bundle, and they're all in these little ones. So when they go to ship them out, that's all they have to do. Well, yeah, just some lint on the window, which is to be expected from a cardboard box. But yeah, as far as I can tell, inbox, it's perfect. There's that for you. This is the Pop Animation Deku, five, number 564. This is the Hot Topic exclusive. The difference between this and the standard is this is his upgraded suit that he gets later on in the show. Um, the standard Deku Pop is just his starter suit. And then there's also a battle damaged one that was another exclusive that's hard to find. And then there's a onesie variant of him as, like, a little kid. That was also, actually, I think it was a Hot Topic box also. It was, that one was a GameStop, actually. But, yeah, it looks like Deku gets a lot of love from Hot Topic. Other ones in this line are All Might, Weekend, Todoroki, Deku Training, Suyu, and Shota Azawa. So it looks like this is actually uh, line two. Instead of being a variant of normal Deku, I guess it's actually, well, it's got its own full number, too. But it's part of the, the second line was the Deku training. That's actually kind of weird, but thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and hope you have a great day. Bye.